Over the years, we've made it very clear that the USC Dornsife LA Times poll isn't just a survey of political campaigns, which candidates ahead and which candidates behind. We want to reach further and we want to reach deeper. We want to get, develop a better understanding of what Californians think about the real world issues that impact their daily lives. So when the controversy erupted in Ferguson, Missouri several weeks ago, we wanted to ask Californians, not specifically about a controversy half a continent away, but we wanted to ask them what they thought about the relationship between law enforcement and the people of their communities. And the findings were fascinating. And the basic finding is that the police, at a time right now of steadily declining crime rates, um, are very popular. Uh, more than four and five voters in California um, approve of the way uh, the police do their job. They say they have a tough job and they do it well. Um, but we, what we found also was a, a pretty sharp racial divide. Uh, in, in all of the questions that we asked, whites consistently had a more favorable view of the police than uh, African Americans, Latinos, and Asians. A lot of Californians do believe uh, that African Americans, and to a slightly lesser extent, Hispanic Americans, are not treated nearly as fairly by law enforcement. The poll found that two-thirds of blacks thought that police do treat minorities unfairly, but less than a quarter of whites felt that way. So it's an interesting dichotomy. On one hand, Californians give their police and their law enforcement pretty high marks, but they also recognize that while progress has been made, there's still a lot of work that needs to be done to continue to improve relationships between law enforcement and minority communities in particular. Another question that we asked was whether people could recall any occasion in the last year when they were treated unfairly by the police, and not very many people could. Um, it was a little bit more common among blacks and Latinos than among others, but not very many. And then the same question on whether someone, uh, someone's family member or their friends have been treated unfairly by the police, it was no, but um, about two-thirds across the board in every group said that they knew of occasions when, um, when people were treated unfairly by the police. So usually when you do public opinion polling, people are driven, in terms of their opinion, almost completely by their own personal experiences and the experiences of people around them. If you've had a bad experience with health care, if you've had a particularly good experience with your children's school, then that's the way you answer the question. But on this question, voters were able to draw a distinction between their own personal experience and problems that they've heard about or read about that others have faced. And just because the problem hasn't faced them personally didn't mean they weren't concerned about it.